Hello, happy Thursday. Today for math, we're gonna be going over matching fractions to models, mainly focusing on halves, thirds, and fourths. So let's quick review our halves, thirds, and fourths. So remember, fractions show equal parts of a whole object or set. So a whole, this is one whole. If we cut in halves, this is, it's equally divided into two parts. Thirds are equally divided into three parts, and fourths are equally divided into four parts. So we see if we shade in one part, it'd be one part of two, which would give us one half. If we shade in this one, it's one part out of three, which is one third. If we shade in this one, it is one part out of four, which gives us one fourth. So halves are two equal parts, thirds are three equal parts, and fourths are fourths are four equal parts. So what is a fraction? The top number is our numerator. That's how many fraction pieces you have or how many are shaded in. That's the number, how many are shaded. The denominator is how many equal fraction pieces all together. That's our total amount of parts. So always our bottom number will be two, three, or four. So if we have four cookies and I take two of them, I take two of the total four. So I just took two fourths of the cookies. So remember our numerator is the top number, our denominator is the bottom number. Our numerator is always how many are shaded and our bottom number is always the total amount of equal parts. So for homework what we're going to be working on is we have to look at the colored part of each shape. Which shape shows two fourths? Two fourths, so that would be two over four. So we know two parts are shaded out of four equal parts, two fourths. So which one shows two box, two equal parts shaded and they have a total of four equal parts? We're here, well we have two parts that are shaded out of one, two, three, four, four parts. So that would show two fourths of the shape is shaded. But let's check all of our other ones. We have one, two, three three parts, which would make this object cut into thirds, not fourths, so doesn't count. Here this object is cut into one, two, three, four equal parts, which means it's cut into fourths, but two fourths need to be shaded. There's only one part shaded, so that's one fourth of the object, so that doesn't count, that wouldn't work. Here this object is divided into fourths, but three are shaded, so three out of four are shaded, which means three fourths of the object is shaded and we're looking for two fourths. So this would be our correct answer. So now look at the colored part of each shape. Which shape shows one third? So that's one part out of three equal parts because thirds means the object is cut into three equal parts. So let's look at our, our shapes that are in thirds. This is four equal parts, so that's fourths. Four equal parts, so that's fourths. This is cut into three, so that's thirds, and this is cut into three, so that's thirds. But we want one that is sh only showing one third shaded, which means one out of the three equal parts is shaded. So here, this has two parts shaded, so that's two thirds, so nope. But right here, this one has one part out of three shaded, so one third is shaded, so this one would be our correct answer. So now, what fraction of the shape is green? So I know we have a total of four squares. So our bottom number, our denominator will be four because it's cut into fourths. How many are shaded? One, two. So it'd be two fourths is shaded green. So this is one fourth, three fourth, two fourth, two third. So it'd be this one because our top number is how many is shade, how many boxes are shaded, how many parts. And our bottom number is always the total amount of parts to make up the whole. So this would be our two fourths. So now on the bottom, they're asking us what fraction is shaded purple. And they're asking us to use a slash um, to separate the numerator and the denominator. So the top number goes first and then slash and then our bottom number. So we know our top number is always how many boxes are shaded. We have one, two, three, three boxes shaded, then I'm gonna add my slash. And out of a total of how many parts, our denominator is always a total number of equal parts. One, two, three, four. 
three-fourths of the of the shape is shaded purple so three are shaded out of a total of four parts equal parts all right and that is it for today so just make sure to take your time and look over make sure to count all the equal parts remember halves are two equal parts thirds are three equal parts and fourths are four equal parts all right have fun and we will do fractions again tomorrow bye third grade